Hey, I'm not DK. I'm gonna tell you my story. I make it a t tiny bit personal. I don't really know, but um, yeah. Just thank you for all this, guys. I basically just started making music when I was 10. A lot of people, that's when I kind of like, I kind of blew up when I first started making music. I, 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 I blew up in the underground hyper pop scene, you know? Like, that was a, that was more of a thing back then than it is now, but I was pretty much just fucking around with music. My music still lasts, but this was even worse. I'm gonna show you some, like, this awful stuff I made. Like, like you'll just see. Yeah, going downtown, walk around. Yeah, 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 we're armed with guns. Yeah, yeah. And people say rocket ship is bad. Like that shit is some ass. Yeah, but anyway, I just kept improving. I'm, I've been making like a lot of music since then. Like I've had a lot of breaks where I just didn't make any music, but I really come back to music. I have a passion for it, hoping to improve. And like I know I haven't grown that much, but to me this is crazy because like I have a kind of fan base now. And like the only reason I blew up too, like it wasn't even because my music. I think it was like I didn't blow up. Like two thousand monthly listeners is not that much, but like to say it was just because I was young. I think that was my uniqueness factor. I didn't. I didn't do any promotion. It was just that I went on live streams. A lot of Johnny friends and Team Smart Spark live streams. So I I got a lot of fan base from there. So that really helped me grow. And, and I think already like two weeks of making music, I had a hundred followers on SoundCloud. But I don't know, that's insane to think. I, I, I've grown a lot. I have a more loyal fan base now too. And I've improved a shit ton, so that's insane. And I love, I love everybody who helped me get this far. And I also like invested a lot of, a lot of time and like probably like a thousand dollars to be honest and like all plugins and stuff. Cause I made music on Mac for a long time. I couldn't crack anything or it was really hard to get cracks. So I had to like, I'd buy it from the studio for 300, bought serum for a hundred, you know, stuff like that. It was insane too. It's like, I, I I don't know how my mom just supported me or something, but because I got a shit ton of this, like I don't think I'll ever earn that money back from music because I don't think I'm ever gonna get to a point. This is just a hobby. I don't think I'll ever do this job. That's just a fact. But I'm so grateful that I have this time to just make music, make so much friends. I have so much friends I've made from Discord, from just like music related stuff on SoundCloud. But I appreciate everything. But it's just been an insane journey and stuff. So yeah, I really appreciate all that. I just fucking love all of the friends. Of, like, like if, you, if you're watching this, you know who my friends are. Like, if you're that friend, you know who you are. But I just appreciate you guys so much. Like, even, like, <laughs> a lot of you guys shit on me too. But I just love you guys. So thanks. I don't, I mean, that's all, that's all about me. I can say, I don't know what else to say. I love you guys. Bye, everybody. Oh, and I forgot to mention one thing. I'm, I'm really gonna start trying to make more content, not just beats, because like I still up with this, not like not that much at all to be honest. But I want to make more content on music, cause I, I like content creation now. I'm gonna still do music, but I also want to make some content out of it. So maybe leave comments if what do you want to see or something. I don't know. I'm gonna try to bring the channel in that direction or something. So have a great day, everybody.